to subscribe! They came to the hospital for a baby's health checkup. Hello, Harry. Crum, crum. Hello, Bada Crum. Today, we came to get the baby's health checkup. Oh, really? Then wait a minute. Let me see. Today, the baby should have a medical examination, a dental examination, a physical examination, and an x ray examination. Dr. Poby will be waiting inside. Okay, shall we start the checkup now? I'll check with a stethoscope to see if there is anything wrong with the baby's health. Good job! Fortunately, the baby is in good health. Let's move on to the next examination now. Now the stethoscope examination is done. Open your mouth, please. <coughs> Let's take a look at the baby's teeth to see if there are cavities. Good! The baby's teeth are very strong too. Let's move on to the next examination now. Now the dental examination is done. Now, let's measure the baby's height and weight. Please put the baby on the examination table. Don't move, just wait. Good job! The baby is very healthy. So, let's move on to the last examination. Now the physical examination is done. Now, let's do an x-ray to see if there's anything wrong with the bones. Please put the baby on the examination table. Good job! The x-ray is perfect! You did a great job until the end! Fortunately, the baby is very healthy! Now the x-ray examination is done! All examinations are done! It must have been difficult to get the examinations, but you did a really good job! <laughs> Good job, everyone! Bye-bye! <laughs> Bye-bye! <laughs> okay, goodbye! <laughs> goodbye, everyone! Crum, crum. The evening time has come. Bororo Krong and the baby came home. Since we went outside, we have to wash ourselves clean. <laughs> First, Let's take the clothes off.
preparing a bath for the baby. Well, shall we Hooray! play bubbles together? <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> Shall we wash? Now let's wash the baby's body. lotion evenly on the baby's body. Apply the lotion like a gentle massage. to bed. Carefully, put the baby on the bed. <laughs> the baby must have fallen asleep. Now turn off the light. The baby seems to hate the dark. I have to turn on the lights again. There's a problem. The baby isn't falling asleep. Prepare items that make the baby sleep well. 
Give the baby a teddy bear. Show the baby the mobile. Cover the baby with a blanket. Now the baby is ready to sleep. I'll read a storybook. The Three Little Pigs. Once upon a time, the three little pigs, who were close together, decided to build their own house. The first pig built his house out of straw. The second pig built his house out of woods. The third pig built his house out of bricks. But suddenly, the big bad wolf came along. Arg, I will eat all the pigs. The big bad wolf went to the first pig's house. I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Boo! The big bad wolf blew the house of straw in. The big bad wolf came by the second pig's house. I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Boo! The big bad wolf blew the house of wood in too. Finally, the big bad wolf came by the third pig's house. I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow. Oh, the third pig has fallen asleep. The baby has finally fallen asleep. All of a sudden, Bororo and Krong fell asleep with the baby. Good night, friends. Huh? Oh, the current's too strong! Complete the bridge so our friends can cross the river. Pick the bridge with the right shape. all cross the bridge. <laughs> Thank you so much! You're the best! 
Pick the bridge with the right shape. all across the bridge. <laughs> Thank you so much! You're the best! Oh no! Our friends are trapped in the magic wall. Answer the questions correctly to free them. Answer the question and get rid of the bricks. Two. Six. Seven. Two. Ten. One.
seven. Ten. Four. Nine. Eight. Five. Eight. Our friends escape the magic wall. You're really clever. Thanks for saving me. Answer the question and get rid of the bricks. Six. Ten. Eight. Eight. Ten. One. Nine. Seven. One. Eight. One. One. Ten. One. Nine. Nine. Eight. Seven. Escape the magic wall. You're really clever. Thanks for saving me. Eddie can see his friends' minds with his glasses. What is Loopy thinking about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
What is Petty thinking about? What is Pororo thinking about? <laughs> what is Poby thinking about? <laughs> what is Chrome thinking about? The friends were all surprised that Eddie read their minds. Wow! That's amazing! A magic spell made Krong enormous. Chrome grew to be as tall as the sky. <laughs> Chrome became as small as an ant because of Tong Tong's magic. Wow, Chrome changed back to normal at last. His friends all sighed with relief. A scary shark is chasing after Bororo. Toby danced to lure away the shark.
the bad shark ended up being thrown out into space. The friends all worked together to help Eddie. Eddie felt grateful to his friends. Thank you!